Mark, we have got a lot of news to get to today, but we are anxiously awaiting word from the White House. President Joe Biden is expected to speak at any moment. We will cut in as soon as he takes the podium. But now let's get to the news of the day because the first school in the Midlands has moved to remote learning for the next two weeks. News 19's Alicia Niavis joins us now with the very latest from Casey Elementary School. And Alicia, what do you know so far about what happens for the students? Darcy and Andrea, beginning tomorrow, all students at Casey Elementary School will move to remote learning. This is only a temporary move. District officials tell us this move was based on the direct impact of COVID-19 at this school. We have some action happening right behind me. The line of parents waiting to get into a door at the far end of the school building to pick up their iPads in preparation for tomorrow. District officials tell us they made this decision not only because of the number of students and staff who tested positive at the school, but also due to the number of students and staff who are quarantined. While students are out, there will be no athletic events. These activities will be back on when students get back to that in-person learning. As for free student meals, Weekly meals will be available to pick up in front of Riverbank Elementary. This is going to be from 11 a.m. to 12 p.m. on Monday, August the 30th. And then again on Thursday, September the 2nd, same time, same place. District officials ask parents with any questions to call food services. But ladies, for now, students are set to return to class Thursday, September 9th. District officials say this is based on the COVID-19 situation at the school, so that date is apt to change. We have submitted some questions to the superintendent as far as the current number of COVID-19 cases at this school, the current number of people in quarantine, and maybe if this protocol is set to change when students get back, are they going to do anything to change anything with their COVID-19 protocols? We will relay that information as soon as we get it. For now, we are live in West Columbia. Alicia Neavis, News 19, WLTX.